Hi, this is Jeff again. I uh, hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install an e-commerce gallery um, to the Photocraty theme. Um, I showed you how to set up and install uh, the Photocraty theme in my last video, and I never really got to go over how to set up an e-commerce <coughs> gallery for the shopping cart. But in this video, I'm going to do that. Um, basically, I've logged into my uh, WordPress installation and I'm going to click on add new page I've already gone through and set up all my e-commerce settings if you haven't done that you'll want to do that first just by clicking e-commerce settings under theme options <coughs> so I'm gonna basically create a page called prints and these will be prints uh, for sale once you type in the title you want to immediately click publish and now you want to insert a gallery so just click on new photo credit <laughs> new photo credit gallery and then type in your title select e-commerce you can leave those blank this is for um, album types if you're creating an album but we're creating an e-commerce gallery so you just select e-commerce scroll down you can leave the aspect ratio as is you might want to play with this if you want now I'm just going to click Add Images, and I'm just going to select four of my, oh, these aren't mine, but four photos that I, I want to sell prints for. And those are going to be uploaded. So just wait a few seconds, and they'll, each of them will upload. Then what you want to do is click Save Gallery, and then click Publish again, or Update, I'm sorry. and then once you scroll down you'll click on edit gallery and here you can <coughs> select e-commerce which will give you some options on what what sizes that you have available if these are only available in one size here I'll show you that in a second first click edit metadata and here you can add a caption to each and you can of course change the order if you want this one to be second in the list Maybe you'll have to drag and drop. I thought you could change these, but this doesn't seem editable right now. Um, so, just adding a quick caption. So once I've done that, I'm going to click Save Gallery. And then I'm going to go back and edit the meta description, or the, sorry, the e-commerce settings. So click on e-commerce. And then you can select, these are the options that I set up in my, in the theme options under e-commerce. So I've added 5x7 and 6x9. If these are only available in 6x9 or whatever size you choose, just select that and then click Save Gallery again and then Update. Now you can view this page 
by clicking view page and then open link in a new tab. And now you have an e-commerce gallery and then you can change where this caption shows up in your e-commerce settings. I think I left it as default so it shows underneath. Um, I think you can leave out this the title of the JPEG or whatever file type you're using and just show the description and then it includes a nice slide or a light box so that you can go through each one and then you're able to add these to your cart and it shows the price and everything you can change the quantity to one and now it shows that I have one landscape photo in my cart and then once you click on shopping cart it shows you that and then you can check out as you see that the the gallery that I just created the e-commerce gallery isn't sh showing up here so if I want that to show up in my main menu I would click on I'm just gonna open this in a new tab real quick menus <coughs> And then I can select prints. And it's probably a good idea to have the shopping cart button somewhere in your menu as well. Click Save. And now, once you go back to your site and hit refresh the link will appear now in the menu. Now I wanted to leave this page open for this e-commerce gallery because I wanted to see if there was a way that you can um, <coughs> password protect this page in case you only want to show this to a certain client but I don't see a way to do that password protecting uh, posts and pages is native to WordPress so I'm not sure why it doesn't show up here if that's not important to you then uh, then it won't be a problem. But they might be uh, updating this theme in the future to include that in case you did want to sell only to a certain client. Um, but that's basically how you create galleries. You can create as many as you want just by clicking add page and then going through that setup again. So you can have prints or landscape prints any types of images for sale directly on your website. So I hope that was helpful. Um, be sure to subscribe. Um, I'll be making more videos in the future. So please stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Bye.